So I'm doing this video because I have had trouble getting this radio to work. And um, you know these companies like to sell you these little buffer amplifiers and all that. It's not necessarily important on all these radios. The problem is that the IF frequency of this radio is listed as 73.05, but if you tune it to that, that will not track with that. I can put the headphones on right now and I can listen to this signal. I need to zoom in the bandwidth. I don't need to look at all that because that's broadcast. We're on 40 meters right here. This is the IF frequency. This is the actual frequency on the TS-570SG that is the closest to what I need to basically get the radio to track. I can turn the dial, go to another conversation on here, look on here, put the headphones on from the laptop, and listen to the same signal. There'll be a slight bit of delay uh, because of community uh, computer processing. And this is just basically SDR sharp. I'm not really a fan of it, but I used it to easily find the IF frequency, whereas SDR Uno was very difficult. Um, so I will probably, now that I know my exact frequency, I can enter that in SDR Uno after I get it to work with this. I'm not going to use my SDR Play to do all that. I might even order another one of these and like maybe one of these other radios or something like that. These ones don't work unless you get the better one because they've got like an eight or nine megahertz IF. But that one's possible and that one's possible with the cheap one. So there's just kind of a beater radio that works really good. And somebody else had put a tap on it but they had it backwards. And uh, I've had it for a couple years.